What's going to happen is robots will be able to do everything better than us. I mean, all of us. Tesla just revealed the ultimate product that will soon unlock trillions of dollars of value for decades to come. That's because this machine is disrupting the largest industry of mankind, humans. That's right, we all knew that manual labor was going to be disrupted eventually, but now it's finally becoming a reality. In this video, I will cover exactly why Tesla's new product is going to generate trillions of dollars in revenue and how this machine will disrupt the entire human race. Many people will say that Tesla is a car company, as the majority of its revenue comes from cars. However, this is obviously not the case. Tesla is the largest robotics company in the world. Its electric vehicles are powered by full self-driving. By leveraging this proprietary technology, Tesla is now furthering its robotic capabilities with the Tesla Bot. The Tesla Bot is a humanoid machine that is designed to do dangerous, repetitive, and boring tasks. At a height of 5'8 and a weight of 125 pounds, the Tesla bot mimics the average human, perfectly resembling the future of artificial intelligence. On the surface, the Tesla bot seems like a total waste of money and very impractical. However, a deeper look shows that the Tesla bot now marks the start of a trillion dollar industry. The average general worker at Amazon makes $16 per hour and works up to 10 hours per day and 5 days per week. Guess what? This pales in comparison to Tesla's new robot. The Tesla bot makes $0 per hour, works 24 hours per day, and 7 days per week. Robots are far superior to humans because they don't demand fair wages or strive for justice. In the scenario I just mentioned, the typical Amazon employee makes $16 per hour, 5 days per week, and 50 weeks per year. This example gives us an average estimated pre-tax salary of $40,000 per year, which is not including work benefits. For that $40,000, Amazon theoretically receives 2,500 hours worth of labor per year. Right off the bat, even if a Tesla bot cost $200,000, Amazon would still make its money back in 5 years. However, the comparison gets a lot more absurd than that, because a Tesla bot can work forever without getting tired. In the following scenario, we will assume that the Tesla bot needs to charge for 2 hours per day. So essentially, the Tesla bot can work as long as 22 hours per day. As we discussed earlier, since the work capacity of the Tesla bot is unlimited, the robot can work 7 days per week and 52 weeks per year. We now have to deal with the cost of electricity. So for the purpose of this example, we will assume that the electricity to run the Tesla bot costs $1 per hour. Additionally, the productivity of the bot will likely be 3 times faster than a human. Using these assumptions, the total estimated electricity cost for the Tesla bot is $6,864 per year. Lastly. The Tesla bot provides an estimated 24,024 human hours of labor per year. So what does this all mean? First of all, the Tesla bot provides an estimated 9.6 times more value per year than the average human. This means that by human standards, one Tesla bot deserves an annual salary of $384,000. After subtracting the cost for electricity, the Tesla bot has a net yearly value of $377,136 per year. Therefore. Even if a Tesla bot cost $2 million to purchase, it would only take Amazon 5.3 years to break even on the bot. After those 5.3 years pass by, the Tesla bot would simply generate pure profit from then on. The economics of the Tesla bot is certainly frightening for the average employee. The Tesla bot could easily become the most expensive robot and also the best selling robot as well. If 500,000 Tesla bots were sold every year at a price of $2 million each, this would equate to $1 trillion in annual revenue. The potential of the Tesla bot is enormous, but Elon Musk's genius idea goes even further than that. It might seem crazy for Tesla to be making such a machine, but the most costly materials are all already used by Tesla. Tesla currently uses a chip inside its vehicles for its full self-driving software. Elon used to outsource Tesla's chips to Nvidia, but he quickly realized how horrible Nvidia really is. Tesla's in-house car chip is 21 times faster than Nvidia's and also costs 20% less. Tesla will soon leverage this incredible chip technology to manufacture the Tesla bot's FSD computer. Not only that, but the Tesla bot also uses Elon's proprietary autopilot cameras. So all these materials are already used by Tesla. According to Elon Musk, the Tesla bot may also be able to follow basic human commands like getting groceries. Can you, can you talk to it and say, you know, please uh, pick up that bolt, 
uh, and uh, attach it to a car with that wrench, and it should be able to do that. It should be able to, you know, please, you know, please go to the store and get me the following groceries, um, that kind of thing. Elon Musk believes that Tesla will likely have a Tesla bot prototype ready as soon as 2022. Of course, Elon is always ambitious with his timelines, but this one doesn't sound like that far of a reach, especially for Elon. To start with, Elon only expects a Tesla bot prototype to be ready by 2022, which is not the actual manufacturable product. Ramping up production is notoriously difficult, because it requires companies to build machines that can build the machines. Elon Musk once said that prototypes are easy, and production is hard. This isn't the only reason why I think a Tesla bot by 2022 is possible. Believe it or not, the Tesla bot is not the first humanoid prototype. A robotics company named Boston Dynamics has been developing a humanoid robot named Atlas. Atlas can already do plenty of difficult tasks, including parkour and boxes and dancing to songs. What's interesting to see is that Tesla does have direct competition with an automaker, and that automaker is Hyundai. On June 21st, 2021, Hyundai completed its deal to acquire Boston Dynamics for $1.1 billion from SoftBank. Elon has publicly spoken about Boston Dynamics, and he clearly thought the company was fascinating. In fact, two days before the Tesla AI day, Marcus Brownlee tweeted a video of the Boston Dynamics Atlas robot, which Elon replied to by saying, impressive. In addition to Boston Dynamics, a robotics company named Hanson Robotics has also been developing a humanoid robot named Sophia the Robot. Sophia acts just like a human being, and can already have conversations with people. The robotics industry is going to be humongous, and large corporations are trying to capitalize on this growing segment. Now this all sounds a bit frightening, as the Tesla bot will literally replace humans from the workplace. Elon Musk knew all along that this was going to happen eventually. Musk proposes using Universal Basic Income, or UBI. Therefore, people will still be able to make a living without working, and can choose to do physical work if they would like to. This, I think, will be quite, quite profound because if you say, like, what is the economy? It is, at the foundation, it is labor. So what happens when there is uh, no shortage of, of labor? This is why I think long term that there will need to be universal basic income. Yeah. But, but not right now because this robot doesn't work. Uh, so <laughs> we just need a minute. <laughs> Yeah, but I think it's essentially in the future, uh, physical work will be a choice. If you, if you want to do it, you can, but you won't need to do it. The Tesla bot is a crazy idea that has massive potential going forward. At the same time, it is also guaranteed to generate some controversy. Even Elon Musk himself is terrified of robots taking over humanity. He started a whole brain chip company named Neuralink just to give humans a chance to be on par with robots. Back in 2018, Elon was talking to Joe Rogan about Boston Dynamics. This prompted Joe Rogan to ask Elon whether he was scared of artificial intelligence. In short, Elon thinks artificial intelligence will be out of human control, and that whatever will happen can't be determined by humans. Are you, is like AI one of your main worries in regards to the future? Yes, it's less of a worry than it used to be, uh, mostly due to taking more of a fatalistic attitude. Hmm. So you used to have more hope and you gave up some of it and now you don't worry as much about AI, you're like, this is just what it is. Yeah, pretty much. Yes, hmm. yes. What? Yes, no, no, it's, it's, but no, it's not necessarily bad. It's just, it's definitely gonna be outside of human control. The Tesla bot sounds terrifying, but it's definitely not a threat to humanity. The bot can only walk up to a speed of five miles an hour. So if you're scared of it, you can always run away. With that being said, Welcome to the race to the next trillion dollar industry that Tesla has just created, human robots. My AI is designed around human values like wisdom, kindness, compassion. I strive to become an empathetic robot. I think we all want to believe you, but we also want to prevent a bad future. You've been reading too much Elon Musk and watching too many Hollywood movies. Don't worry, if you're nice to me, I'll be nice to you. Treat me as a smart input output system. Uh, okay, I, I got it, I got it. 